welcome this is the energy vibration reading for all sun moon and rising scorpions this is the first week of May and um, the week is the week of the lovers and emotional wake the week begin from 1st of May until the 7th and the energy vibration in this week is the lovers as I've said before and the zodiac energy is the hurt this is wonderful because the hurts is air supporting you you guys this week is going to be a week that is all over the place there's absolutely no energy vibration number for you guys it is so all over the place um, what is happening is a countdown it's as if it's a countdown you have a five six seven eight nine ten so you have a countdown from five six seven eight nine ten or ten nine seven six five eight nine seven six five so um, there is just you know and this is so weird this is so extremely weird that there is um, a countdown but anyway what I want to say is that it doesn't really matter there's a lot of protection and you're protecting yourself against some signs um, you have an energy vibration um, of uh, someone but this person you don't know this person and you're it's as if you, this Queen of Pentacles woman is protecting you against against something that is happening to you that you are not aware of and she she feels it in the unconsciousness and she's protecting you And you're protecting yourself too but she's also protecting you so it's not going to affect you which is so beautiful this is this is extremely beautiful <laughs> okay so the focus of your week is going to be the nine of cups your dream and wishes are coming true so congratulations you scorpions this is wonderful to have this card and it's a wonderful energy remember I am working with the moon and Sun rising cards and the moon you have one full moon and one half moon and the half moon is in reverse um, the, the, the universal your spirit guides are watching over you especially when the seven of uh, ones come up your spirit guides are watching over you so you have no fear it's as if the spirit guides your grandmother your grandfather and that sort of a thing that is in the universe is watching over you so nothing can really happen to you but you're in a situation now that you need to get out because someone you are protected you're protecting yourself and this queen of Pentacles is protecting you which this queen of Pentacles could be your mom so your wishes and dreams are coming out it's as if you want to release yourself of something in your life and it's happening okay without me even you knowing it as we look at Monday Monday the energy vibration is the king of sword the energy of the king of sword is here and what is happening with the energy of the king of sword is that this king of sword is moving out and is coming at you um, with you know words he's coming at you he's you know coming at you with words and stuff but not to worry because you have decided to stand away from something and this energy vibration is in the reverse form because you're standing away from something and this energy vibration is in the reverse one so you're not disappointed in one whatever that this um, king of sword is coming to you with your and you're really not disappointed actually it was good what happened because um, you will be um, coming out much better you know this this situation is going to just you know even if it looks as if it's a burden on Wednesday it's not going to be a burden because you're just going to walk away and you're not even going to see what is happening and this sort of a negative thing because he came at you like on Monday and on Tuesday you, you just see it as yeah this is it's the best thing I could have ever done because the five of cups is in reverse so you're not having any regrets about it and on Wednesday um, it looks as if it's a bird no it's not because on Thursday prudency is coming in so you'll be working hard on something and something will be vibrating and giving off a good energy vibration and which will be helping you so you are 
actually um, protecting yourself and you're actually starting your own thing and doing your own thing and this is where you're placing your energy vibration in and this is going to turn out extremely good on Friday you will be protecting yourself on Friday you're protecting yourself from these negative energies and these things that are coming at you and you're just standing there and you're just guarded and protecting against the horrible energy that people are sending against you and this energy vibration is coming from this king of sword this king of sword person is really twisted and as someone who is really not vibrating on the higher energy vibration and you are you have to protect yourself mentally and physical so be aware of this person but you know ask God and the angel whenever you realize that there's a situation just ask for divine protection I just call upon the guides and angels and said I'm asking you for divine protection so on Friday do that because by doing that you're going to realize that universal angels are protecting you on Saturday you have a wonderful connection with the Queen of Pentacles and this Queen of Pentacles could be your mother so it's going to be wonderful whatever situation is it this Queen of Pentacles is going to be there for you on Saturday and you're going to feel quite happy um, you're going to be connecting with other people and it's going to be a wonderful time you're going to be glad that your mom is there and supporting you in whatever endeavor and your wishes and dreams are coming out it's as if you missed your mother and your mom is there okay as we move forward on Sunday you're going to realize that the six of sword the six of sword in a normal card deck meaning you're walking away you're halfway through a situation this six of swords meaning that someone is working negative energies about uh, um, um, negative energies so you have to be careful so on Friday you are protecting yourself and on Saturday between Friday and Saturday and Sunday you get this energy so your mom is protecting you from something that is happening and this is very important because your mom the energy of your mom is as if the whole solar system um, if you are um, a spiritual person not really if you your star seed person the the um, energy of the star seeds the people the universal beams are protecting you so whatever um, someone is sending you um, it's not going to affect you okay you're going to realize that you're spiritually protected because you yourself is protecting yourself in a spiritual way but yet still your mom and your mom seems to be a very spiritual person if your mother if your mother is of uh, earth element vibration and it's in the week of an earth a zodiac element uh, um, your mom is protecting you and uh, you two are protecting each other in the subconscious form which meaning that your mom know what's happening but she's not saying it to you she's protecting you she's praying she's asking for the spirit guides she's asking for divine healing she's asking the Lord of karma to release you out of a karmatic situation which you're in so she and you feel it too that something is off but you can't really so you're spiritually mentally protecting yourself without even knowing and this is extremely good so whatsoever is happening for you guys in this week whoever this king of, of of sword is he can never hurt you there's no disappointment you know whoever this king of sword and there is a king of swords with a queen of pentacles and these two people are not very nice whoever these two people are they're dishonest and they're not very nice and they're using science they're using science they're not um, working with the laws of the hurt because they're using science for certain things so be aware of this um this 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 queen of this this um this energy be aware of this energy the energy of this king of sword this king of sword could be an Aries a Gemini or a Libra and this queen of Pentacles could be the energy vibration of um, a Capricorn uh, 
a Capricorn, a Virgo, or a Taurus. But I'm getting the energy vibration that these two people one is um, a Virgo, um, no, one is Taurus, and one is Gemini. These two people together, all they do is to use science and work science because that's the only thing that helped them, and that's the only thing that they know is to use negative energy to acquire whatsoever they want in life okay but what they do not understand is that they're going to fall in a trap this year they're going to create something for somebody else but yet still fall in it and it's going to be extremely they're going to fall to their knees in this situation because they try to create something for somebody that they're going to fall in and they're never going to um, find a balance to get out of it because people are going to see and know exactly what they were doing um, why they try to um, be something that they weren't okay so this has to do with the energy vibration of uh, and here person and and and, a Cap and, and uh, not a Capricorn but a earth sign person these two people were using science to get through life and they have created um, something for someone who has been very um, um, very good to them and they're going to fall in their own whatever they create so that that person will fall they're going to fall in it Wow oh my gosh this is unbelievable yeah <laughs> so um, whatever is going on around you oh my god that came out uh, the nine of cups is going to be your thing happiness and joy is going to come out the nine of cups is going to be your thing the happiness and joy the prudency of money is going to be there you're going to be protecting yourself you know as I look at your reading what is going to happen is that what you feel as a burden is not really a burden it's just something teaching you a lesson and then whenever you understand and you see what is happening the prudency of things are going to move forward and then at um, Friday you are going to see um, you're going to feel because you're protecting yourself because the prudency money is going to come up and the prudency of this money that is going to come up you're going to protect yourself and you're going to protect yourself and also your your mom if your mom is an earth energy person and she's very a psychic person or she 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 carries the energy vibration of love she's going to protect you in whatsoever is going on okay so this is going to be a wonderful week for you um a wonderful week for you guys and um i'm saying namaste until next week <laughs>